the story of how SpongeBob manages to kill a great white shark. <laughs> Time to go jump off a cliff. I'm okay, everybody. Well, at least I still have my beautiful foot. I don't want to say that because it used to be the Krusty Krab manual. Absolutely. It's for kids. I made it for you kids that are watching. Anyway, time to go work. Herc. No, wait, I gotta watch TV first. Work isn't, doesn't even start in an hour. Here. Here. Patrick, get out of my way. I'm gonna watch TV. Breaking news! There was a very destructive thing called the Great White Shark. But one of them is huge, and it's flying, and it's destroying the whole town! Out of Bikini Bottom! Everyone! Everyone! We're in danger! Or, we need help! Help! So anyone! Hunters! Grab out! The army! We need the army! In order to defeat this thing! We need cannons and stuff! Ugh! Ugh! Here, here comes the army right now! Sorry, we're not coming. Hey, our helicopter's broken. Oh man! And yeah, but literally, hey, there was a great white shark about to crash into the town. So literally, run for your life! Um, uh, was that Lily found on the outside my um house? <gasps> Army. He. I'm gonna call it all my sword. Though. A sword! This guy reminds me of Rejuvenator. Or from uh, Steven Universe, the movie. Everyone, and this is not actually the story of how how he killed the Great White Shark. This is actually part one of how, how he he kills the Great White Shark. So um, stay tuned for part two.